Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to open WebP image in Photoshop or save any image as WebP in Photoshop by the very simple way. First of all, just go to the files in Photoshop, open and open any WebP images and it's showing a error message. Click on OK. Now, first thing is just close your Photoshop first. OK. Now, just go to the link given in the description. I give you two links. First link is the mega. Second is the Google Drive link. Go to the any link and just click on download as a chip. Click on show all. Show in a folder. Minimize it. Drag this to desktop. Close this. Now right click on this chip file and click on extract file. Click on OK. Here is the our folder. Double click on it. It's contain another folder. Double click on it. Here we find two folders 32 bit, 64 bit. If your machine is 64 bit, then go to the 64 bit. If your machine is 32 bit, then go to the 32 bit. My machine is 64 bit, so I go to the 64 bit. Double click on it. Here is the one file. Just select that file. Right click on that file and just copy this file. Okay. Now minimize it then just go to the this pc in this pc just go to the c drive just go to the program files here just go to the adobe and just go to the your Win adobe version adobe photoshop version i am using adobe photoshop 2021 so i go to the photoshop 2021 okay double click on it then just go to the plugins plugins folder here is the plugins double click on it and just paste our file at here and click on the continue and close this now just go to the start apps open our photoshop now just go to the open and just go to the our web image here is the my web image just open it and our web image is open in photoshop now i just open any image jpg image and just go to the and just this is an psd image and just i want to save as jpg then just click on the control s or control shift s and just go to the save type as webp and just go to the desktop and save this image so i give you my webp and save it and give the quality 100% and okay now this PSD image is saved as the WebP image on our desktop. So guys this is the simplest way to solve this problem. So guys thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.